hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today we are going to be looking at the best web hosting for wordpress in 2019 right so um we all know what, what wordpress is uh, maybe you're trying to start a blog you're trying to you know wordpress to us at today hosts over 30 or if not 40 percent of all the websites on the internet i wrote a very detailed uh, article about which web hosting is best for wordpress in 2019 so I'll do to popular demand and making a video, you know, explaining the best web hosting for WordPress in 2019, right? So, um, you know, the internet has grown in leaps and bounds and website is one of the, you know, major things on the internet as of today. You know, uh, WordPress is a popular CMS system for building websites and it powers about 40% of the estimated 1.5 billion websites on the internet today. So, um, a lot of websites, if you go to wordpress.com and come down here to showcase, showcase, right, you see a lot of websites that actually run on WordPress. You know, build, um, powerful websites, like City of New York, you know, this runs on WordPress, uh, Be Right, Facebook Newsroom, uh, Glad, whatever it is, all these wonderful websites, they run on WordPress loss in rates bits rather you know um the village voice um ugly film matter south africa vogue india this is finland um which one canada.com but obama foundation obama.org they all run on wordpress you know there's this misconception misconception about wordpress that it's not very secure it can be cannot be used to build robust website you cannot you know all those things are just what it is you know misconceptions people don't know they think well, wordpress can only build blogs and all that nope you can build a full-fledged website with wordpress and wordpress actually makes it easy to build websites you know uh, for me, starting out on the internet, you know, I was writing HTML, CSS, PHP and everything until I discovered WordPress, right? And before WordPress, I actually tried Drupal first, then Joomla, then I found WordPress very easy, right? And I'm sure a lot of persons actually do find WordPress easy, which is why it powers over 40% of the of all websites on the internet today, including these ones that I've mentioned. You can just go to wordpress.org slash showcase and you see all the sites you know that that are run on wordpress uh cms sites business sites let's look at business for instance you see expo glivy the world disney company right boosting market toyota motors brazil lots of big company bloomberg professional post by target right they all run facebook newsroom sony music new york times they all run on WordPress, including whitehouse.gov. They all run on, you guess right, WordPress. So um, if you are thinking of building your, web, your website, you should consider WordPress because it's actually very, very, very easy to use and uh, very robust too. You can basically do anything with it. So if you come to colleges, you can find a few colleges that actually use WordPress also. MIT, Sloan, University of Manitoba, in, in Georgia State University, this is Canada, right? Georgia State University in the US, Nicole State University, a lot of them run on WordPress. UCF College of Medicine, University of Mary Washington, they all run on WordPress, right? So WordPress is like the way to go. If you're trying to build a website or you want to learn how to build a website, you know, you should actually focus on WordPress because it's very, very, very easy to use and very robust. You know, that's my take. Then, um, but today we are going to be looking, like I said, on our best word. Uh, web hosting for what or for WordPress, you know, there are some web hosting companies that are dedicated You know, they have like a special theme for WordPress You know, so we are going to be looking at all these today And these are based on the ones that I have used personally over the years that I've been building websites and I've found a lot of them You know, the first we are going to be looking at is GoDaddy, right? You know, GoDaddy is very 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 big, very big. I think they're like the biggest when it comes to domain you know, but we're looking at WordPress web hosting, you know, so WordPress web hosting with GoDaddy is actually very interesting. You know, I tried it. Uh, where is GoDaddy? GoDaddy. Okay, this is GoDaddy.com, right? I'm logged into my account. So we're going to be looking at a few things, you know, um, uh, let's see, let's see their plans. Let's see their plans for their hosting plans. 
you know uh she plans some pricing you scroll okay waiting for you to load my internet is kind of slow so uh, just be here with me you know and i want to encourage you please if you are new please subscribe to my youtube channel and also hit the like button you know the thumbs up button and notification bell button so that whenever i drop a video you will uh, be the first to know if you like this video please leave a comment in the comment section and if there's any concerns anything you don't agree with please also leave a comment in the comment section i respond to my comments almost immediately right so um business web hosting is telling you that it supports magento joomla Drupa, wordpress right there's hardly any hosting company that do not support wordpress so so uh, let's see plans and pricing for uh, this okay so this is it i actually talked about it in my blog here onlinehustle.com.ng you know i have it here basic deluxe ultimate and pro 5 right and all the advantages that come with them wordpress hosting yes we're looking at wordpress hosting wordpress hosting made easy fast and simple blah 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 okay this is it right so if you look at this place you find out that these they are basic they are basic WordPress hosting, it has allows one website, 10 gigabyte storage, you know, all this, all this, all this, which is good. Free domain we purchase, you know, which is standard and everything. But if you come to this place, you see, but there's something here. This guy has free SSL certificate for the first one year. This guy has it here too, right? It is not on this basic and deluxe plan. I remember my plan was a deluxe plan, right? But I had to move my hosting away from GoDaddy to side ground. I had to move it away from GoDaddy to side ground, you know, I'm, uh, because of some issues I had with GoDaddy. I actually believe, in my opinion, I think GoDaddy is a great company when it comes to domain, but I don't think it's that big, it's that good when it comes to web hosting. You know, um, I moved my hosting from uh, GoDaddy to side ground upon recommendation, and I noticed a few things. My site become, became faster. You know, and I didn't have to pay for migration. Um, site ground actually managed, actually did the transfer. I just gave them my GoDaddy login details. They transferred all my website, over 20 of them, free of charge from GoDaddy to the uh, to a site ground. So that's something I think that is that is wonderful. When it comes to GoDaddy WordPress hosting, hosting their promises 99.9% .9 uptime, which is you know like almost correct. Free two four seven support and all that, right? If one of the major issues I had with GoDaddy is that their chat system, they don't have their support system is not very wonderful, right? Like if you come here and click, and you go to no thank, just show me phone number or we stock, right? You know it, it's not easy to actually find um, their customer service and chat with them or something. And most times when I spoke with them, it was over the phone. I had to call this number to actually talk to them, and it's not convenient. One time I asked the customer service, I said, why don't you have a functional chat system on your, on your phone? They said that their customers prefer talking on the phone. Obviously, I'm not one of those customers. I don't know if you are, but I'm not, right? Which is one of the reasons I moved to SiteGround. So um, I talked about it here, my take on GoDaddy hosting, you know, customer support. That's one of the issues I had with them, you know, which I moved for when I moved to SiteGround. So if you see that calls and chat system, this is it. It kept loading, right? So if you want to buy um, a domain with GoDaddy or hosting with GoDaddy, you know, here is the link. I also have a link in the description box of this video. So, so let's go to SiteGround, right? SiteGround is another interesting, I found it in 2004, another very interesting web hosting company. You know, they said there's an interesting thing about SiteGround. When after I moved to them, I saw my the speed of my website actually increase right and they have a managed wordpress hosting site ground managed wordpress hosting i talked about it uh, here site ground managed wordpress hosting you know these are their fees and all that so let's take a look at this i guess you can get started and look at their their plans so this is it managed wordpress hosting Powerful yet simple to use. Officially recommended by WordPress.org. Look at this. I'm going to talk about this in a little while. So, this is side ground. If you come here, you notice that there is no domain. They don't sell domains. As in like selling domain alone. So that's something that will tell you that their dedication is web hosting. That is what they are dedicated to. 
So they have a, a plan for WordPress, they have for WooCommerce. We're actually on WordPress, so SiteGround.com, WordPress hosting, that's where we are. So let's see what they got. So their plan is, we didn't compare the prices here, did we? Okay, this is 6.99 per month. Their deluxe is 9.90, you know, for small businesses and all that. So this guy starts at 3.90, which makes it cheaper. This guy starts, you can, they are, and they are go geek. It's 11 points. So obviously this is a lot cheaper, right? So if we're looking at their price, one website, this one for 5.95 a month, you get unlimited website. Unlimited website, right? Unlimited website. This guy, one website, this one, one to two, this one, five to 50. Five to 50, right? But so this is better, you know, this is better, a lot better. So um, let's look at, if you look at this essential, for instance, you find out that they have free SSL. Can you say it? Free SSL and HTTPS. 247, um, what's it called, support, and all that, on meter traffic, blah, blah, blah. You know, they have the same thing here. And so across all board, they have free SSL, but uh, good that it doesn't have that. It doesn't offer free SSL here. It doesn't offer it here. It offers it here and here right but across board that's one of the things that actually attracted me to SiteGround. they have free ssl across board so it doesn't matter what you are buying you are sure that the https your ssl you are getting it you know free emails everything those are standard but i was concerned about this free ssl because if you're buying ssl elsewhere you know you're going to spend a little money for that so this is it you are spending 7.88 per year you know for buying ssl or you can actually get it by a domain and hosting from SiteGround and you know get it free of charge you buy hosting and give you domain and hosting free of charge so i think uh, i i I've, I've been using um my wordpress hosting with SiteGround on some of my website and I, it's been amazing but then there's an issue i also have with SiteGround. Yeah, i just have an issue with them too you know, that is very fast compared to godaddy and all those it's very 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 fast you know um they have all the these are promises you know they have all these their uptime is top notch and everything right and it's also just like they told you here our uh, site ground is recommended by wordpress.org the official website for wordpress recommended this particular hosting company which it, it, it tells you a lot about the hosting company right and wordpress so my take on site ground hosting you know i moved to site ground after i had issues with godaddy you know it's everything they moved my site 20 websites uh, completely free they migrated it for me free of charge they offered me free ssl on all my domains at no extra cost of course you know it was a great improvement i made a video here on how to install site ground free ssl on all domains you know, which i did so um but i had an issue my website went offline you know they sent me an email telling me that my grow big plan blah 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 right here the grow big is supposed to be unlimited websites right unlimited websites and they also have all written of essential features have and it also has the premium which is wordpress super catcher blah 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 one click okay all that which is fine but i had an issue i logged into my account and i saw that this thing this inode usage was filled up it was over three three hundred thousand and all my sites were offline automatically so what did i do i contacted them and they told me that the inode is not supposed to be you know, so i had to start deleting folders inside folders and files and everything that were not active right so finally 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 i moved to i moved to and this is the plan i was using it's supposed to be unlimited website so i moved to um bluehost right so i'm gonna I'm gonna get to bluehost in a little while so this is site ground if you want to buy hosting with site ground please use this link i like them i still use them it's wonderful it's a lot better than you know it's recommended by wordpress it's very fast and awesome you know, but the only issue I had with them was this inode stuff. And their customer service is just mind-blowing. Just contact them immediately. Just come to their chat box. You know, it should be somewhere. Um, okay, contact us should be immediately. Log in for support. Of course, you have to log in and everything. You know, you're connected immediately. So if I log in right now, you see me because it connect me almost immediately. Right? So um I'll leave a link in the description box below if you want to buy hosting with SiteGround, you know. So that's that's two. Then three, we are going to get to Bluehost. So after I had this inode issue with Bluehost, I knew that I was going to need another hosting 
right? So I did my research and I went to Bluehost, right? Bluehost.com. So let's. This is Bluehost, right? It's 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 an interesting um, uh, web hosting. I just started using it and it's it's been wonderful. They also offer you free SSL certificates on across all hosting. You know, free domain for one year, which is basically standard, and their price is cool, three point nine five per month. But this is uh, okay. Let's just click on get started. WordPress, WordPress hosting. Let's see. Let's look at the options. So we can compare with the others. So it said choose plan. Choose plan. I click. Okay. So the here, here they are. But I also have it here on my site, on my blog rather. You know, experts. Okay. The interesting thing about Bluehost, Bluehost is has a special dedication. As like it's as if it's designed for WordPress. That's the truth. It's as if it's designed for WordPress. Um, the company that actually owns Bluehost, uh, where is it? Endurance International Group. They also own HostGator, iPage, and a whole, a whole lot of other web hosting companies. But Bluehost is WordPress focused, which is why it is also recommended by WordPress.org, right? So um, that's something interesting. That's something that you know it's it's mind blowing. So here are the options: three point nine five. 5.95 blah 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 so um if you look at uh, this is it free ssl free ssl across board you know so SiteGround and bluehost offers free ssl this guy gives you 50 gigabyte ssd storage while uh side ground sorry i have to go back back okay while side ground their basic plan offers you offers you 10 gigabytes for the same price right then their grow big offers you 20 gigabytes you know so let's look at a uh, 5.95 let's look at side ground 5.95 but it offers you unlimited uh, unlimited unlimited that's basically what it means and you have unlimited website this is actually the plan that i am on you know if you have unlimited website this one offers one website you know which is basically what this guy have one website also this is 10 gig and uh, the bandwidth visitors 20 gig and 25,000. Let's look at this. This is unlimited, unlimited, unlimited subdomain. 200 it even gives you $200 marketing credit, you know, for Google Ads. This is super awesome. I've been enjoying it since I joined them, and it also gives you automatic WordPress. But one of the issues I had at first was that it's a little different from all the other the interface. It's a little different from all the others I've used in the past. Okay, this is it. I'm logged in here right now. So this is Bluehost, you know, all that. I'm not creating my website. I'm just going to click. So you see how basic it is. So it took me a while to figure it out. Well, about a minute or two, I was able to figure it out. Unlike the others I've used in the past, you know. So um, basically, this is what it is. So I think um, Bluehost... I, I, I'm enjoying Bluehost, that's the truth. You know, I'm enjoying it and I've been recommending it to a lot of persons. I also have a link here with which you can actually purchase a Bluehost hosting. I also leave this link in the description box below. You know, so um, if you use my link to buy any of these things, they will, of course you get a robust discount. I have like an agreement with them. Okay, and last but not the least, we are going to look at Dreamhost. Dreamhost is another interesting web hosting um, uh you know, company and it's all guess what it's also recommended by wordpress.org WordPress the official wordpress uh, site so wordpress hosting starts by it starts from 259 which is like the cheapest from everything that we've seen so let's let me more and see the other options they have you know so your plans overview shared hosting for wordpress manage wordpress uh, wordpress hosting vps for wordpress hosting so this is 2.95, 2.59 every month. Learn more about shared, shared hosting. This is it. Let's take a look at it and see what it entails actually. So it gives you one click instant, instant WordPress installation, which is what basically uh, uh, all of them gives you. So um, this is 2.95 a month. Free domain included, one website unlimited traffic, WordPress pre-installed, fast SSD, free SSL certificate across board. So everybody gives you free SSL certificate except GoDaddy. No? So this is it. 
limited website for this the same price with uh blue blue host and side ground 5.95 unlimited website free domain included unlimited traffic you know so there's no cap like this guy has a cap here on traffic has a cap here on traffic it has a cap here on traffic right hundred thousand every month um this guy doesn't do that unlimited traffic unlimited traffic there's no cap at all you know with a uh, dream ho with dream host i think that's 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 something interesting so if you look at their managed wordpress web hosting it's also another interesting one dream press dream press plus blah blah, blah. so uh, this this is awesome uh, so let's i i, I said i'm going to come back to the fact that this guy is uh, recommended by wordpress.org officially this managed web wordpress hosting from SiteGround is officially recommended by wordpress.org you know uh, this guy too is recommended and dreamhost is recommended but SiteGround is sorry good that is not right so what do i mean by that uh, this is where i showed you the sites that are built to wordpress please i want to encourage you to subscribe to my channel and also leave a comment in the comment section so this is Bluehost, right? If you come to wordpress.org slash hosting, you see that there are thousands of web hosts out there, the vast majority of which meet the WordPress minimum requirements. And choosing one of the crowd can be a chore. Just like flowers need to write environment, WordPress works the best when it's available. We've dealt with most hosts, and we can imagine, and we can imagine in your opinion how hosts below represent some of we've dealt with more hosts than you can imagine. In our opinion, the host below represents some of the best and brightest of the hosting world, right? So that is why they recommended Bluehost, Dreamhost, and SiteGround, right? So I think they actually um, put it in 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 like the best, you know, Bluehost being the best and SiteGround being like not worst, whatever word you want to use. So this is the best, this is better, and this is this is best, this is better, and this is good. In my in my opinion, I think that's what they what they mean by this. So um, they offer this three offer free SSL, you know, unlike most other ones, and the whole lot of other you know customized stuff for WordPress. And the, two, the good thing is that most times when you install WordPress with the one click installation, especially from Bluehost, they will automatically put in a few plugins for you that will help you know make building your website very easy. So um. Coming to the end of this video, I want to encourage you guys to like my channel and uh, subscribe, leave a comment in the comment section and also subscribe to my YouTube channel. Again, in my opinion, I think Bluehost is the best. And fortunately, my opinion and the opinion of WordPress.org is the same thing, right? Followed by Dreamhost and then SiteGround. So if you want to buy, do, buy hosting from any of these companies, please I'll have a link in the comment section below. Please use it. I have a link in the description box below. Please use it and make your purchase. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video. Keep winning.